Business Insider, 27th of September 2022. Take a look at China's fleet of destroyers, including the Type 055, which cost $920 million to build and is considered one of the country's most powerful warships. The US, China's primary rival, has the second largest navy in the world, with 296 ships, per a 2022 report by the Center for Strategic and International Studies. Though it is smaller than China's People's Liberation Army Navy, the U.S. Navy is still widely considered the most powerful today, given its presence, partnerships, experience, and technology. China is trying to take the same role in the world that the USA is presently playing to be a superpower. China, though, is determined to build a world-class military able to fight and win wars. While China already has a lead in terms of navy size, it continues to expand its naval force. The Congressional Research Service predicts that the country's fleet will grow to as many as 400 vessels by 2025 and 425 by 2030. And it is also investing heavily in improved combat capabilities for its ships. China has strengthened its navy over the past decade to bolster its military presence around Taiwan. China relies on its growing navy to enforce its will and advance its national interests in the East China Sea, South China Sea, parts of the Western Pacific, and potentially farther as its force grows and improves. The South China Sea is where China's militarization is most noticeable, despite President Xi's clear commitment to not militarizing the Spratly Islands, China still built several bases in the area. China currently takes advantage of such areas to increase its intimidation and coercion of many coastal governments in Southeast Asia and weaken their attempts to exercise their sovereign rights under international law. The Chinese Navy's growing fleet of destroyers is comprised of 41 active ships, which belong to eight classes, according to a 2022 estimate by military data site Global Firepower. Let's look at all eight of China's destroyer classes. The classes are ranked according to when they were commissioned, from the most recent to the oldest. 1. Type 055, Renai. Type 055 is the Chinese Navy's newest class of destroyer. Due to its long-range firepower, it has been described as the world's most potent warship. The Chinese Navy has said there are plans to expand the class to a fleet of 16 ships. There are currently six of these ships in service. Some experts consider the Type 055 the world's second most powerful surface combatant after the U.S. Navy's Zoom Vault class destroyers, per a 2020 report by the China Maritime Studies Institute at the U.S. Naval War College. One of Type 055's most notable features is its vertical launching system. Type 055 has a total cell count of 112, with each cell measuring 0.85 meters, or around 2.8 feet, reported the diplomat. The destroyers are also fitted with electronic warfare countermeasures systems that include DU jammers and Type 762-4 decoy launchers, per the military site Naval Technology. 2. Type 052DL, Luyong 3. There are two variants within the Type 052 class, Type 052D and Type 052DL. The flight deck of the latter is 13 feet longer to accommodate the Harbin Z-20 helicopter, per the Defense Agency Janes. Over two dozen ships belong to the class across the two variants, per the military news site Naval News. Kuenmyang, hull number 172, commissioned in March 2014 was the first active ship in the class, according to China Daily. The ships are active under several commands, including the South Sea, North Sea, and East Sea fleets, per the official site of China's Ministry of National Defense. The ships have a multifunction phased array radar MPAR, system, which means they have long-range air defense and modern anti-ship missile capabilities, per the U.S. Naval Institute. 3. Type 051C, Lu Zhou 
there are only two ships in the Type 51 c class, Shenyang, Hull No. 115, and Shijiazhuang, 116, per naval technology. Shenyang, the lead ship in this class, was launched in December 2004 and commissioned in October 2006, per the news site. The Type 51C was the first class to be outfitted with the Russian 30N6C1 engagement radar, which is similar to the US Navy's and slash SPY1 radar system, according to a 2020 paper by Sarah Kirchberger, an assistant professor at the University of Hamburg. 4. Type 52C, Luyong 2. The Chinese Navy has six Type 52C ships per a 2020 paper by the U.S. Naval War College. According to the paper, the introduction of this class into the Navy's fleet marked the start of China's modernization of its surface combatants. Lanzhou, Hull No. 170, was commissioned in July 2004 and was the first ship in the class, according to the 2009 warship reference book Jane's Fighting Ships. It was also the first Chinese warship with air defense capability, per a 2017 report by the China Maritime Studies Institute at the U.S. Naval War College. 5. Typo 52B, Luyongai There are two ships in the Typo 52B class, Guangzhou, Hull No. 168, and Wuhan, 169, per a 2008 CRS report. According to the military website Global Security, Guangzhou was launched in May 2002 and commissioned in July 2004. The development of the class represented a significant innovation in the Chinese Navy with the adoption of features like smooth and angled surfaces, which resembled the most advanced European destroyers, per the military website. The Typo 52B was the first locally built class to demonstrate air defense capabilities, per naval technology. The news site reported that it is also equipped with anti surface and anti submarine features. 6. Typo 51B, Luhai Only one ship, Shenzhen, Hull No. 167, belongs to the Typo 51B class. The diplomat reported, citing a defense report. Shenzhen was commissioned in 1999, per the state-run China Daily. The ship is tasked with near-seas active defense, which is China's naval strategy for protecting its surrounding waters, per the 2011 book The Chinese Navy, Expanding Capabilities, Evolving Roles. According to China Daily, the ship underwent upgrades in 2017 to improve its combat capability. China's Navy also refitted the ship's weapons and electronics systems in 2014 as China modernized its older fleet. 7. Type 52A, Luhu There are two ships in this class, Harbin, Hull No. 112, and Qingdao, 113 per a 2014 book by Dennis Gormley, Andrew Erickson, and Jing Dong Yuan, experts on China's military. Harbin was launched in August 1991 and commissioned in May 1994, according to the Navy database site Sea Forces. The class consists of the first domestically made modern multi-role surface combatants equipped with comprehensive surface strike and air defense capabilities, according to the authors of the 2014 book. The ships have a significant suite of Western design weapon systems and sensors. 8. Type 956CM, Sovereigny Type 956 is the only active class that is foreign-built. The Russian-made ships are comparable in size to the U.S. Navy's Aegis-equipped missile cruisers, per naval technology. The Chinese Navy has four of these ships, two modified to suit the Navy's standards, per the military news site. The first ship was delivered to the Chinese Navy in December 1999. According to the military news outlet Jane's Defense Weekly, the modified ships were purchased for over $1 billion in 2002.